Yo, what's up? It's your boy Johnny Sierra. And today, I'm gonna do something a little bit different than vlogs. I'm gonna take one of these cars, well actually, not one of these cars. I'm gonna take a car more expensive than these, and I'm gonna pick up some girls. It's gonna be epic. This is Model K Payne and Getty Damn Radio, and I am here with Johnny Sierra. Is that correct? How are you? Johnny Sierra. I'm good. I'm good. How you doing, Sierra? Good? I'm good. Can you tell me about yourself? Uh, what do you want to know? There's so much. Man. So start... much about me. Okay. Tell me what you're working on, what you're doing, or where are you from? How you get? I'm from New York. You're from New York? What part of New York, yeah. sir? From Brooklyn, New York. Yeah, I'm from Brooklyn, New York. Um, I'm a management consultant out here in Dubai, and I also do some uh, some comedic things, you know, some sketches, some videos. I'm also a huge car collector, so I do that as well. I like collect cars and manufacture cars with my partners. So yeah, that's what I do. Management consultant, car collector, avid car collector, okay. and comedian. What kind of cars do you collect, man? Um, well, I, I own a Batman, a Batmobile Tumbler. Okay. So that's pretty big. It's a pretty big car. You, you know for the movie Batman? Yes. Yeah. I have a uh, 2014 uh, LP 700 uh, Lamborghini Aventador as well. Um, and I have uh, a Lexus, like an LS 400 Lexus. You know what I mean? So, but the cars that I collect are, of course, the sports cars. Okay. All right. That sounds Lamborghini. nice. So you like fast cars? Yeah, fast, has to be fast. I live my life fastly. I love things that are fast. All right. Yeah. So you said you like you do comedian work? Is that what you said? You're a comedian? We do a lot. I have a lot of friends who are like social media influencers. You know that that are on social media. Like I have friends. I'm friends with a guy named Ali Vinsueli. I'm friends with Vitaly. Vitaly ZDTV. He's a big YouTuber with like 10 million subscribers. So what I mean by comedy, I mean like pranks, like pranks. We do like little vines, short sketches. And I, I do that for fun. You know, I'm so busy with work that I need to like kind of calm down with, you know what I mean? And just like yes, relax. This, this is what I do. I do that every fun. It's picking up pretty, you know, pretty good too. About uh, two months ago, I got picked up. My one of my videos got picked up by Media Takeout. So they posted that. Got about a million views on that. That was pretty cool. And um, yeah. We don't know what's going to happen. So, what know. is what is your future plans? May I ask? What happened? What is your future plans? May I ask? Upcoming plans? I'm a manager consultant, so I actually opened up a company with my friends. Uh, with my friends who turned partners. Uh, you're gonna meet one. His name is uh, they call him Benghazi Red, but his name is Sean. Uh, and another guy from Germany by the name of Paul. We opened our office in Shanghai as well as in Germany. And this year we just opened our office in Dubai, first office in the GCC. And our plan is pretty much strategic management for companies. We do uh, full-fledged marketing solutions from A to Z, from whether it be malls, construction companies, uh, TV, radio shows, we're, just, we're, we're marketing consultants. We make sure that from A to Z, you know, their their company, you know, gains, uh, gains the audience that they want. Right. Uh, the audience that they need, yeah, in terms of marketing. That's, that's what good. we do. That's how we get our money. Absolutely. Yeah. That's that's good. Congratulations on all your success. Well, that's thank good. you, thank you. I'm 27 years old, so I think I'm I think I'm doing all right. Okay. <clears throat> Are you a my family life, man? Huh? Are you a family huh? man? Family man? What does that mean? A family, wife, kids, or just family? No, very no. family oriented, no, or no. <laughs> no, no family for me. I'm uh, single. Okay. Um. I, I plan. I plan on being single because there's so much of the world that I want to see on my own, and I want to learn on my own. So when I do have that partner, I can share those, you know, what I mean? share those moments, you know, with the, with the person that I fall in love with. Like, hey, let's travel here. 
and that I can show them like an adventure. You know what I mean? Absolutely. I do things a little different right now. I'm really focused on work, really focused on just my life and becoming that man or that woman. You know what I mean? Oh, that's so nice. That's Love being it. considerate. Wow. Cool. Uh oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> I see a hat. Wait a minute. Get on in there. Get on in there. So, you gonna tell me who this gentleman is right next to you? Well, this is my partner, Sean. Uh, it's his birthday, actually. It's I birthday, know. Sean. Happy birthday, Sean. And he's, he's also, he work, we work alongside of each other. He's actually, he does a lot of concerts, event management, like physical events. So, I know in the United States, they do like, you know, with you made in America, with like someone came out there in the United States, right. Dubai, we're trying to do some of my content. Okay. He's actually the brain behind it. Strategy, strategic management, right. security, everything. Right. Made to set. That's like good. So, we that solution. so let me give the camera to him. Okay. I hope that was a great you know, little time. Guys, feel free to you know follow me on the Instagram. Put my good. Can show. you give us all your since you just swiffing away from me so fast? Can you give me all your social information, social media information, please? Yeah, I'm at Johnny J O N N Y S one. E-R-R-A on Instagram and of course my YouTube if you want to see some funny stuff it's Johnny Sierra J-O-N-N-Y S-I-E-R-R-A 718 with YouTube.com slash Johnny Sierra 718 um, and yeah I'm not leaving so bad <laughs> <laughs> no I can tell me what bad team you know. you're good um, do you have, have any shout out I have my calling me it's two hours she's like you need to go to the office you need to go to the office because we're having, we're having a concert on Friday with a guy named Lloyd Banks. Lloyd Banks, yeah, I've so, heard of Lloyd Banks. Yeah, so Lloyd Banks, yeah, so... Uh, yeah, he's from New yeah, York, so too. Flying, okay, right. from New York. Flying in with another member of the unit. We're doing a big concert. So she's calling me because I have to get the whole voices ready. Sean has to go to there and cut the check. So anyway, I hope everything is all right. Thank um, you. You got to have um, any shout-outs for me? Shout-out to my mama. I love you. All right. <laughs> Thank you. You rock. What's up, people? Hi, Sean. Hi. How you doing, sir? Hi. Can you tell, tell the bit, people a little bit about yourself? A little bit dressed. <laughs> Yo, we went partying last night, so it's like... You dragged. We just get crazy. Well, happy birthday. Uh, thank you, love. So What's tell me about now? yourself. He, he touched bases on a little bit of what you do. So you want to end cap on that? Yeah, right now we just basically be moving heavy out here. Okay, I got this HD consultant going. We're actually uh, managing a lot of uh, Emirati social media influencers. Okay. Like, uh, um, there's a guy named Ben Bass. He has like three million followers. Uh, another dude named Mo Vlogs. I mean, these guys, they, they they work hard. You know, they do videos, they do all types of skits and little comedy skits. And, did you tell about the vision that we have? Of, uh, <laughs> because there's Islamophobia going on in the U.S. And a lot of these guys, I mean, a lot of the people in the U.S. they look at the Middle East in a different type of, you know, different type of light. It's actually super awesome out here. People are really peaceful, at least where we are in Dubai, and um, it's something that everybody needs to come out and experience. So what we're trying to do here now is that because okay, me and Johnny both from Brooklyn. All the partners from Germany. My family's lived here about 17 years, though. Okay. So, we, uh, you know, we own companies out here. We get industries. Uh, we do, uh, like, uh, what do you got up here? And, uh, we serve the military with parts and different, different stuff like that. But then me, I'm kind of like, I do my corporate thing, but I'm also into my, into my entertainment stuff. Okay. What about the, are you still doing music? Yeah, I do music. Um, I'm an artist, but I'm more focused now on the business part of it. I'm managing artists, but um, I still play around with it. It's always the passion is always there. So I love the music. Absolutely. Actually, got a video. we're about to, I'm about to drop a mixtape out here. With some, I mean, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some local rappers from Dubai and I'm going to mix them. There's another country close called Oman. They love the hip hop scene. Some of the rappers are actually okay, they're good. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a mixtape. It's gonna be called um, From Coming to America, um, NYC to DXP. Okay, that's what's up. 
shoot a bunch of videos, you know. Well, make sure we get a hold of all that, okay? Yeah, of course. Uh, and I got a DJ for you to help you uh, do that mixtape, okay? You see, you got some beats for me, right? Yep, I got beats. I got a DJ for you. Um, you pretty much you got this information, DJ Da Vinci. He that call, so make sure you link up with him. He most definitely will take care of you, okay? Yeah, no doubt. Um, <laughs> is there any future plans that you want to tell us about that you want the social media to know? We're working on so much right now. Really pushing. Um, we want to do a reality show out here. Um, be we have awesome. some. It'll be super dope, super lit. Um, we've had offers. They want to do like a. Uh, uh, Desperate House, what's it called? Uh, what am I gonna try to do? Yeah, yeah but the love it, we were gonna try to push to get a love and hip hop show out here, but it's not gonna work out. It could though, I don't know. Depending okay. on, 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 because the, the, the hardest thing here is the filming, you know? Why it needs to be seen in a, in a certain type of light, it's just not gonna have it running around filming whatever they want, you know? Right. But we have a few concepts um, of a few different types of reality shows that we want to do. Um, starting to create, we want to create a festival, a huge festival out here. So there's a lot of projects in the pipeline, a lot of, a lot of big things coming. And Dubai is wide open for business. It's like a hub for business, international business. So there's so many people here with so many different ideas, a lot of innovation, tools, and you know, like even Johnny himself, has a uh, what do you uh, invent a uh, he invented some things you know what I'm saying he's a techie on the low I you know see I, mean? I know so multi-talented both of you guys I, I I congratulate both of you guys on your success um the, are you a family man yeah it depends <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> depending on. Okay. Nah, nah, I love of course, I love people that I love. There's people that I love. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Family um, is always good. You know what I mean? All right. It is. Yeah. Would you like to uh, give us a shout out and let us know? Is there anybody you want to shout out for this interview? Um, you know. Gosh, there's too many people to shout out, but especially, you know, the family, my mom, my brother, you know what I'm saying, you, you know what I'm talking about, everybody, you know what I'm saying, shout the people out. And then with the movement, because it's happening, we mix it wavy out here, but I, I'm like, I, I wanted to tell you real quick, like, okay. literally, yeah. and we on the ground running, like, that's it, it's, it's all about hustling and being an entrepreneur, and I'm loving it, you know? Absolutely. Tell me something, tell me, so, um... How you feel about the police brutality right now? In the U.S. Everywhere, yes, sir. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I can't, I can't respect that. I mean, it's like mm -hmm. those are people who are supposed to be protecting us. You know what I'm saying? And, and it's, 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 I read a book by a lady by the name of uh, Michelle Alexander, and she, the book is called uh, "The New Jim Crow." You know what I'm saying? And she was going on in the book about how, you know. And the statistics about how there's a, a lot of black and Latinos locked up and, and more in the U.S. than in any, any other country in the world and how, you know, being in jail is like modern day slavery because they got these inmates in there working for like, you know, a couple pennies. <clears throat> now all these institutions are private. Like, I'm woke. I feel like that's why, that was, that, that's what helped me in my decision to get out of the U.S. You know what I'm, I'm not promoting for people to leave the U.S. I'm just saying, like, you know, there's a lot that goes into it, you know? I, I would say talk all day about the rights and wrongs of it. I mean, the culture. Our culture puts out a certain type of message and it's people, they scared, you know? So I can't, I'm just, it's that still me, I don't know. Sometimes I wake up in the morning and I'm like, yo, we gotta fight, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it's just like, all right, what's the peace thing? I can't promote, you know, you know on social media right now, I don't know what's going on. Okay. <laughs> So are you voting over there since you guys are kind of capable of different things, you know what I'm saying? So Right. But the people that are capable of what they're capable of, right on, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. But uh, that don't want that, then I understand you too, you know what I'm saying? I'm just in the middle. But I just don't respect it, but I don't respect any of it. I, uh, 
that the mentality is different right now. I mean, they're getting away with a lot. They are. And the system is, is not designed is not designed to help people. You know, it's just about this money. So mm-hmm. but yeah. you know what's but one thing that I learned stepping outside of the country, coming and getting, getting money on an international wave is like it's different because now I'm sitting over here watching America like it's a third world country. Like I'm sitting in shock, like damn that's going on, this is happening, this is happening, it's just not good. You know, sometimes you gotta step outside of things to really see what's going on, and it's, 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 it's not cool. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. I'm so versatile. Uh-huh. I can talk to him, I can walk him through this. Shout out J Electronica. I love this one. It's my song. I spit that. Gotta gutter shit. Young gun running shit. Four fifth rubber grip. Then I'm on some other shit. I switch, I'm gone, I'm on the mother shit. While Lake of my salam, I'm on my brother shit. The girl saying Madonna, I'm on my lover shit. Can't leave the mic alone. I love this shit. I love to spit, put my heart up on these beats. Speak intellect that I got off of these streets. And I'm tired of all these creeps. It's real bad, they still swag. But I got aura and you can't steal that. I feel bad for the kids, they deceiving. They got them believing. Nightmares is dreaming. Chains is gleaming. Life has no meaning. And insides are screaming, they belong to the demons. Poor semen is father made on Twitter and my song one. You can follow me, cause I'm a leader sent by God to help him see through the fog. It's my job, it's my song. Nah, it's not hard. I'ma be here tomorrow. It's your law. If y'all are like me, you kill him in the white tee and try to do the right thing like Spike Lee. They have a half like lemonade and iced tea. I'm one way, it's no way they like me, they blood tight be tainted by the virus, they can't even look a man inside his iris, cause they hiding, nigga and I'm him, the one God designed to go and find him, and expose him, that ain't G shit, nah that ain't wavy, that ain't C sick, there's no way a G gonna say they see shit, school of hard knocks, where they teach this, this is deep ish and everybody stepping in it, spin street shit, everybody represent it, but they don't Realize jail and the death come with it Lead the G shit to the G's I recommend it One of the best that did it Cause I put the effort in it Yeah I keep a weapon But listen it's a lesson in it Live life cause death comes in just a minute Never forget every curse has a blessing in it Yeah I told y'all I can do what y'all do But y'all can't do what I do I'm smarter than you niggas <laughs> I got more heart And I'm smarter than you niggas I can bag your chicks I can go to war with y'all, and I can outdick y'all. That's G shit. Let's get it. It's us, nigga. We in the building. Red, did you hear that? We in the building, nigga. My nigga, Fred the Gun, Joe Stump. Let's get it. I told you, niggas, man. The revolution might be weaponized, man. We taking over this shit. It's us, nigga, we in the building I'm who I said I was, are you? Salute me and shoot me, nigga I'm a general Ha <laughs> ha